So morning drive, photojournalist Larry Buell introduces us to two of Wichita's morning teams. Save 39, Mike and Mac, KXLK. Mike and Mac on a Friday, it's 8.51. We call ourselves the lowest paid, lowest rate. <laughs> I started in 1963. Mostly it's been morning. Okay, winning ticket, 500 bucks coming up in our 9 o'clock hour. Uh, with Mac, probably the first time around, years ago, here, uh, about three years, and been about four years this time around. We got a couple of uh, XL mugs for you. Just drop by, okay? Okay, what's your address? We're at 626 North Broadway, right across from the uh, funeral home. Just follow the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of energy in our show. Uh, As you can tell, Mike and I work well together. It's the rest of this morning. Cloudy occasional light showers. Thanks, Mac. You're doing a heck of a job here with helping me out here. What did you give me? War and peace? Somewhere it could be because we are be complete opposites. Mike's from Baltimore, and he's very, very short. I'm from Kansas, and I'm very, very tall. Not very tall, but taller than Mike. Uh, Mike's not very good looking. I'm quite, as you can tell, I'm quite handsome. Uh, I'm intelligent. Mike's not very bright at all. I like sports. Mike doesn't know anything about sports. I like women. <laughs> he was trying to have fun. I mean, seriously, we really do, and obviously, uh, we have a tendency to say things, me probably more than Mac from time to time. I like to talk about things that are going on in the community. And when you do that, you're going to step on somebody's toes. Back to the future. K-E-Y-N FM 104. Good time oldies. One, two, three, three. Mornings, you know, you just do whatever you want and... And always remember that it's easier to get permission than it is per uh, No, wait. It's easier to get forgiveness than it is permission. No, 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 no. We've not changed the letter. Not a syllable. Not a word. These people deserve everything they get because they are the original. Knuckleheads in the, the news. news. Propane gas accidentally injected into a city water line caused three toilets to explode in separate... It's very strange to me. Stop with We're always uh, right along the fine line of good taste, but never over it. It's a pretty broad line, <laughs> or somewhere in the general vicinity of it. It's just real spontaneous. Tim and I have, a, have personalities that are, are very different, but they seem to work off each other. Tony is, uh, is so talented with all of the different voices and characters he does. And now with this morning's oral interpretation of your lyrical clue, here he is your host. As time goes on, the music we play is a, you know, we call it pleasant memory retrieval music. Because that's what it is, you know, the oldies is great. I love it. It's music I grew up with. Let's talk a party, talk a party. That's a blast. Wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> that's it. That's it for this edition of Knuckleheads in the News. And tomorrow we'll visit two more morning times. Riding on their shoulders, morning drive time is the most important time period for most stations. And as you saw last night, a number of stations use morning teams to attract listeners. Tonight, in the final segment of Morning Drive, photojournalist Larry Buell introduces, introduces us to the morning crew at KKRD and KICT's Breakfast Club. 107 KKRD, Wichita's only hit radio. We're staring down the barrel of what appears to be a beautiful weekend. I like getting up and knowing this is the time when people I feel like use the radio the most to get their information to start their day, and that makes it exciting. You get, uh, and, and I think a lot of the success of the radio station rides on what happens in the morning. You're telling me I can make that tea time for the weekend then and be okay? We're very lucky to be number one. It's when I joined the station, we weren't number one. We went through some, some different morning people. We tried different things. Um, it, it's really, I don't know, we just have fun in the mornings. We, we play the hits. 107 KKRD. People do tune in for the music. I don't think that, that Bo and I could go to another station and, and be number one like we are here. The music is a real tie-in. 107 KKRD, waiting for the start of fall. Boy meets girl. Your favorite song. Oh, it is. One I love that record. I love that record. I had it cranked up here. We were jamming like salmon. It's Friday. It's 20 past 7 o'clock. Top that 4. Cubs, Cubs Top 7. It's their business to keep you safer and healthy. So mm -hmm. you can... We do about four breaks an hour, and two of those breaks, uh, Scott's with us, and, and Scott interacts, and, and he's a main character. He if your FM sounds funny, it's gotta be the morning crew on 107 KKRD. You like this? Wake up, or you can soon see you wake up. Now, 107 KKRD. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up or eat sushi. It says we have a lot of fun together, um, and we're friends, and I, th I think that comes through on the air. I think it sounds like we're having fun, and we are. That's no joke. <laughs> we're just trying to do some stuff that kind of that fits with the music that we play, which is rock and roll music. 
and just like it's kind of off the wall sometimes and uh, and a little wacky, a little zany, a little out of control, that's how we are. I it's hope. the very first T95 typewriter toss ever, and since the Secretary Day, what we're doing is we're uh, heaving these uh, uh, donated typewriters off the third floor of the Holiday Inn here onto the boss target below. Hopefully entertaining. I mean, that's our mission, is to entertain. We're, we're not uh, heavily, you know, we're not Peter Jennings here. <laughs> we're just trying to entertain and have a good time. And we all work together really well. We really like each other, and that helps. We want to thank Western Typewriter for uh, donating all of these typewriters this morning. I mean, these babies are not cheap. No, they are not. But, but uh, they boy, are they are now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're, they're not the, They're not worth a poot right now. <laughs> the audience of experts. That's what we call our listeners. And they are... KICT95, Wichita's home of rock and roll with the Grateful Dead and the Breakfast Club. I'm Ron Eric. Good morning. I'm Jen. They're going to wheel me in. I'll have a walker. You know, <laughs> no, they'll get, have to expand the door to get my chair in or whatever. If I'm 80, you're never too old to rock and roll. Be nice.